Your Body from Us Born Beginners. Your Amazing Body. Your body is like a complicated machine, always working to keep you alive. Computer scans can show the different parts that make up a person's body. Bony Frame. Your skeleton is a frame of bones that gives your body shape and covers its soft parts. You were born with about 300 bones, many of them join together as you grow. Adults have 206 bones. Femurs are the biggest bones. Places where bones meet are called joints. Joints let you bend and twist. Straps called ligaments hold bones together. A slippery liquid helps bones move smoothly. Mighty Muscles Muscles are rubbery and stretchy. They are often attached across two bones and help the body move. When, mu when one muscle tightens, it makes a bone move. Then another muscle tightens to move the bone back. This picture shows the muscles in your arm and hand. They pull on bones so that you can move your elbow, wrists, and fingers. You have about 60 face muscles. They let you make lots of expressions. Breathing. Your body needs a gas called oxygen from the air. You get oxygen by breathing air in through your nose and mouth. Air goes down a tube called the windpipe. Air fills two big spongy bags inside you called lungs. Then a muscle moves up and air is pushed out again. Lungs are full of thin air tubes. As air reaches the ends of the tubes and fills your lungs, oxygen passes into your blood. When you exercise, your body needs more oxygen, so you breathe faster. Powerful Pump Your heart is a big, strong muscle that pumps blood around your body. Blood flows in and out of the heart through tubes. The tubes go all over your body. Blood flows into the heart. It is carrying oxygen that is collected from the lungs. The heart pumps out the blood. This sends the blood rushing around the body. The blood takes oxygen to every part of the body, then goes back to the heart. Inside your head. Your brain takes up most of the space in your head. It controls everything in your body and lets you think and learn. The wrinkled orange area of this photograph is a person's brain. Here are a few of the things that your brain controls. Feeling hungry, smelling, moving, hearing, learning and remembering, seeing. Dreams might be caused by your brain sorting out thoughts while you sleep. Passing messages. Your brain is connected to every part of your body by tiny threads called nerves. Nerves pass messages to and from the brain. This is what a nerve looks like. It has feathery feelers that touch other nerves to pass messages. The body sends messages to the brain about, it, th about things it senses. The brain sends messages back, telling the body what to do. Nerve messages move at lightning speed, which helps you react quickly to things. Eyes and seeing. Eyes collect pictures of things around you, then nerves send the pictures to the brain. The brain works out what you are seeing. This photograph shows the inside of a person's head from above. Light goes in each eye through an opening called the pupil. A thin layer of water keeps eyes clean so that you can see clearly. When you blink, your eyelids wipe water over each eye. Any specks of dirt are washed out. Ears and hearing. Ears go deep inside your head. The part you can see is a flap where sounds go in. The ear flap collects sounds from the air. First, sounds go into your ear and reach a thin piece of skin called the eardrum. Your eardrum starts to wobble, which makes three small bones shake. The shaking makes a liquid move deep in the ear. Hairs in the liquid sway. Nerves in the hairs send messages about the sounds to the brain. Sound is measured in decibels. The sound of a whisper is about 30 decibels. A plane taking off is 140 decibels.
munching machine. When you eat, your lips, teeth, and tongue work together to break up food. Teeth are covered in a hard coating called enamel. They have roots that go deep into your gums. Enamel is the hardest material in your body. Front teeth cut food into small pieces. A juice called saliva makes food slippery. Back teeth grind food into a paste. The paste slides down your throat. Where food goes. Food that you have swallowed travels to your stomach. Food is mixed in the stomach until it is a thick mush. Next, it moves into a tube called the small intestine. Special juices are added to break up the food even more. Useful chemicals are taken around the body to give it energy. This is the stomach. It stretches to fit in a lot of food. Your small intestine is coiled up inside your tummy. Waste food is squeezed out of your body when you use the toilet. Waterworks. Your body needs to get rid of extra water that builds up in the blood. This job is done by your two kidneys. Blood flows into the kidneys. Water and nasty chemicals drain out of each kidney. The blood, the cleaned blood continues around the body. Wastewater trickles down tubes and into a bag called the bladder. When the bladder is full, you go to the toilet to empty it. In just four minutes, all of the blood in your body passes through your kidneys to be cleaned. Outer covering. Skin holds your body together and gives you a waterproof covering. It is made up of layers. Top layers of skin get worn away. New layers grow underneath. The bottom layer is fatty and soft. Hairs grow up from the roots deep in the bottom layer. Each hair has an oily coating to make it soft and shiny. Salty water called sweat is pumped out of if you are hot. As sweat dries, it cools down your skin. 50,000 tiny flakes of skin fall off your body every minute. Under attack! Tiny harmful things called germs are always trying to invade your body. Germs often get inside your body through cuts and scratches. White blood cells in your blood find the germs and zap them with chemicals. A doctor might give you medicine or pills that contain extra chemicals to fight germs. This cell is splitting in two. This is how new cells are made. This is what white blood cells look like under a powerful microscope. Their long strands help them cling on to things. If germs in your body are too strong to be killed, they can make you sick. Glossary of body words. Here are some of the words in this book you might not know. This page tells you what they mean. Ligament. A tough, stretchy band that holds two bones together. Oxygen, an invisible gas in the air. Your body needs oxygen to work. Saliva, liquid in your mouth that makes food soft and easy to swallow. Stomach, a strong, stretchy bag where food is turned into a mushy mixture. Nerve, a thin thread that passes messages to and from your brain. Germ a tiny living thing that can get into your body and make you sick. White blood cell, a very small speck in your blood that fights germs. That was Your Body from Us, Bur Us Born Beginners by Stephanie Turnbull, designed by Laura Parker and Michelle Wallace, Illustrated by Adam Larkham, Body Consultant, Dr. Christina Ruth, Reading Consultant, Allison Kelly, Roehampton University. And this is EDU Kidspace. Subscribe for more lessons, stories, and books. And if there's something in particular you'd like to learn more about, leave us a comment.